Welcome back. It's literally now March 22. Ugh. I was supposed to have this made already. But it's not. <laughs> oh, the struggle. I was trying to get these shorts done, but then I stopped working on them because I was like, oh, because Valentine's Day was coming up at that time. And then I was like, oh, I need to draw. And then I was like, oh my goodness, since I'm working out at the gym again, I'm so behind on footage. I was trying to catch up on footage because I have all these like home workouts from 2021. And yeah, I'm almost, I'm almost done. But, and then I was like posting up a storm and editing up a storm like on YouTube and on Instagram, a, a ton on Instagram. You gotta say I'm very, I'm very worn out right now. Yeah, so I'm gonna just batch some content, make sure some of my, my posts like pre-made, like the captions, I was working on that today. And then, you know, just have it already edited because I was just doing this and just like editing it one at a time. Are you kidding me? It's so hard, I'm like, ah! Anyways, but I was just like going to stream, like posting like pretty much every day. And yeah, that was a lot. Oh my goodness. I Listen, I need to create. So I know that's not like realistic for me to keep that up, like posting every single day, like nah, it's not realistic. So here I am and it's time to work on these shorts. So let's see what I can do. Hopefully I can finish them. I'm just gonna record it and a film and take you on this journey of trying to get these shorts looking right. So yeah. Second try. I hope this works. Let's uh, try to hem these shorts again. And on the same side. I haven't even tried to do the other side. So yeah. Almost done with hemming it, which means we're almost done. Except I always have the knots that I gotta tie because uh, I'm not good at making the seams. You know, my sewing skills aren't that good, but I figure it out, and I have like all this ideas of like stuff I want to make. So I just do what I can do, and I figure it out. So and I do what works for me. right here it's annoying I can't like I can't focus with that <laughs> check my work well uh, let me try a little bit more let me try to see yeah I need to redo that
Um, I'm not sure if you can see, but I can see. Uh, I'll have to do another angle. All right, y'all. I finished them. Yeah. Isn't that cool? This is how they turned out. Super cute shorts. Yeah, finally finished them, guys. I finished making them because I was working on them all day on March 22nd, and I hadn't worked on them in like over two months, I think. <laughs> uh, yeah, so. But yeah, check it out. I love how they turned out, and also, like, that's all I had to do left the other day to finish the leggings was hem these shorts on each side and they don't roll up or anything like that. I doubled my seam so I did two seams like how you normally would see on clothes. I literally was speechless when I finished them that night. I just was so confused. I was like, wait, are you kidding me? I made these leggings. Like I couldn't believe myself at all. I didn't, I didn't even know my capabilities and now I know like yeah girl you can you can do this you can actually do this and that makes me so happy I'm like yeah yeah that's so tight I still can't believe I made these shorts I know I said leggings earlier <laughs> um that's that's not what I meant I meant to say shorts I just put my tank top up I just you know pulled it up so you can like see the whole look of things I'm telling you I feel like I can do anything now I really do since I made these shorts my man, it's time to make those Bunny Hero Mirko, you know, all that. Oh, I keep imagining it. Oh, it's going to look so cute. But yeah, these uh, Bunny Hero Mirko from my Hero Academia, the leggings. And it's going to have the little bunny poof right in the butt area. Ah, oh, like I am inspired off of that character a lot. I'm trying to get my build back so I can look beast mode, you know. We're going to make the leggings next time. I do want to make, because I still have some leftover material from that dress that I made these shorts off. So you see this? I, I feel like I have enough material to make like a top, so maybe that's what I'm going to work on next. Something of the sort. I altered this tank top that I'm wearing. I'll probably alter it more, but I'm just saying for today, right now, this is the only, you know what I mean? I'm not, I'm not going to do anything more. I just cinched the waist a little bit. Obviously, it doesn't really look like I cinched it that much, but trust me, I cinched it a little bit. And then this, this was a men's tank top that I thrifted on one of my last thrift trips. Um, I think it was like 99 cents. So I was like, yes, picking it up. And I knew since it was a men's one, you know how like on men's ones, they always have it like longer down here. And then like up here for like the shoulders, it's always like up more. So I had to like retract that and trim it down and sew it and put it all back together. And then I had to take this into, which that's why I even cinched the waist in a little bit in the first place. And I did it on both sides and yeah. I still need to alter these ones because these were like a pair of like high water leggings, but then they were like really weird because they fit like big at the bottom, so they just look weird. So I just made them into shorts. I altered them into shorts, and this is my first, this is like my first or second um, successful booty scratch seam because I worked on this one and I was like trying to do like a bodysuit. I know that one's still not finished. It was a major fail, let's just say that. <laughs> but um, it made it where I had like the expertise when it came to doing this one. Like, oh, I knew what to do. These shorts that I made do have their flaws. They're not perfect. So there's like this pattern here and it's like bigger on this side and smaller on this side, even though they still have like the same type of vibe, right? There's like less fabric on this side, which is why it makes the seam here go crooked but I'm not really worried about it because like I said, even the fact that I even, like I said, this was a dress. This was like a super long dress before and then I made them into shorts. That right there in itself, that's a miracle to me. <laughs> so that makes me hype. And I'm like, man, the capabilities, ooh, transforming, transforming all around. Not just like with self growth in general, but like I'm transforming 
in all my capabilities, my skills and abilities that I can do. So yeah, really hype. Each part where there was like a seam on the inside, I would hand sew the inside of the under part to that seam area, you know what I mean? And then tighten the knot to like secure it and everything. Any part on the bottom of the hem, that's what I did. I just put my hair in my favorite low ponytail braid. Gotta train, gotta get stronger, you know what I'm saying? Yeah! Anyways, it's gonna end it here. I hope you enjoyed this video or series of videos because I don't have a lot of space on my phone and I make these videos recorded on my phone and edit them on my phone so that's why there might be like parts to it. Yeah. Stay tuned for more. Now I'm gonna be making more cool projects in the future. Yeah, I'm gonna be coming with the content. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. The Alterist, I'm out!